Hey everyone! Welcome back to my channel. Welcome if you are new here. My name is Margie and I post uh, shopping and grocery hauls, lifestyle videos, vlogs, and everything in between. So today, what I have for you guys is gonna be like my kitchen stuff haul. I don't really know what to call it, but you'll see in the title what I end up calling it. So, without further ado, let's get started. <music> First thing I want to share with you guys is my marble stuff. I have a lot of it. I love marble. If you can't tell, I have it as my banner on my YouTube page. So the first thing are these plates. I did get three of these. These are from Dollar Tree. And I wish they had four because I feel like four is like a full complete set, you know, but they only had three. So I am going to be on the lookout for another one of these. And then to match this, these little bowls, they're pretty small, honestly. Like if you look at the size of my hand compared to this bowl, it's smaller than like a regular bowl, I feel like, but it's decent size and it's cute. I like to have like things that match, especially marble stuff, beautiful. So I got those. Oh, and then I got, I got four of these. I'm not gonna show you all of them, but I do have four of these. And I also have mugs to complete this set. I have four mugs. Um, I don't know where they are right now. They're somewhere in my basement because I got all of my stuff for my future house for my kitchen from my basement. I tried to find, I think I found most of it, but some stuff I don't know where I put it. So that'll show up when it shows up. The next thing is this. Oh my God. I love this thing. When I saw it, I was like, yep, I need to get it. This is so cute just to like have on your countertop these four marble mugs and it's cool because they're stackable so I love that about them this is from oh I took off the price tag but this is from home goods actually and I believe it was $9.99 which is a good deal I just love this I fell in love with it I think it's so cute all right the next thing I have it's marble-ish kind of not really some I don't know it's kind of it's this spoon rest. It's really big, really heavy. This was $6.99 at Home Goods. My mom actually got me this because she got herself one that's like similar to this. And I was like, oh my God, why didn't you get me one? And she was like looking for one for a while and they didn't have it, but they finally had it. And she picked this up for me. I love this. Oh my God. I think this is beautiful. I can't wait to have this on my kitchen next to my stove. Just put the spoon on here. Beautiful. All right, so I think that's actually it for my marble stuff. So now this is gonna be really all over the place because I have my stuff spread out all over my bed right now, like everywhere. So, okay, I'm just gonna start with what I could see. So this is from Dollar Tree. It says glass bottle. Um, I'm gonna use this in my future house for probably like maple syrup or something, or like some type of syrup. I'm not really sure yet, but I thought it was so cute for a dollar. It has like a little cork on the top, if you could see that. Yeah, so that was a dollar. And then I got these two stemless wine glasses. These are also from Dollar Tree. Dollar Tree has really nice like kitchen stuff. If you guys haven't shopped there for your uh, kitchen stuff, you're missing out. So these are a dollar. These are really nice glass. Like They're pretty thick too. I feel like these will be reliable and if they break, whatever, they were a dollar. So that's those. And then I have these as well from Dollar Tree. These are like bigger glasses. Doesn't really say like a name or anything, but I love the texture on these, if you could see it. Like little kind of dots everywhere. And then there's four little um, like indented parts around the glass, like the bottom, which I thought was so cute. So I got two of these. Sorry, I'm going to try to go through this stuff kind of quick because I don't want this video to be too long and I have a lot of stuff. So next thing, I love these. These are so cute. These are a uh, salt and pepper nil set and they're like mini, like they're not the huge ones. Normally they're like kind of taller, probably like around there, but I thought these were so cute and I can't wait to use these in my house. I love having like salt pepper grinder type. And eventually I want to put like pink Himalayan salt in the salt one because I think it's so cute. And it's supposedly better for you, I think, too. I'm not sure. 
But yeah, this is really cute. This is actually from Walmart. I think it was around 15-ish dollars. I don't quite remember. There's my price tag on here. But pick you up one of these. You're going to need it. Next thing, this is from Goodwill. This was $2.99. And this is like one of those like uh, sealable containers for like pasta or whatever. Which I think is cute. I want to get more of these. I think they sell them at Target. So I might get like the whole set eventually. But I like these because the lid doesn't come off unless you press the button. Which like unseals it. So it's going to keep everything nice and fresh in here. Good deal for $2.99. I can't wait to use my, put my pasta and stuff in here. My neighbor was driving by. Sorry. This next thing is so cute. It's from Goodwill, also $2.99. Hot cocoa, five cents. Cute little sign to hang up somewhere in the kitchen. I love this type of look, like where it's like, I don't know how to describe it, but like, yeah, I don't know. It's just really cute. So yeah, that, and then it has like a little thing so you can hang it right there. Cute. Hi, Lori. My dog is in here this time. I don't know if you could hear in the last video, she was barking. All right, this, just a basic um, muffin pan. This is from Goodwill, this was $2.29. It looks like it's in really good condition. And it's like the mini ones, not like the full size cupcake muffin, whatever. But I think that was a really good deal for $2.29. You can tell it's like, it looks brand new, like literally. And these are normally much more expensive at like another store, so I got those. I got that, I mean. The next thing I have is this little clear, like, veggie and, like, dip tray, I guess. Like, fruits, whatever you could put in here. Chips, cheese, doesn't really matter. I thought this was cute for a dollar. This is from Dollar Tree as well. My dog is laying on the floor by all this stuff. Look. Nori. What are you doing? Look over here. <laughs> she hates being on the camera. All right. So the next thing is a sandwich maker. This is from Goodwill as well. This was what, $4.99. Um, when I opened it in the store, one second. You can tell it's brand new. Everything's still in there. It's still packaged up nicely. So I thought this would be cool to make like paninis and stuff. And that's a good deal for $4.99. Normally these go for a lot more in stores. The next thing I got were these uh, two piece mason jar salt and pepper shakers. There's a really bad glare, sorry. But I thought these were so cute. They're so cute. I kind of want to open it and take one out, but I also don't want to because then I have to, meh. But you can see on the back, they show one of them filled with the pink Himalayan salt. Ooh, so cute. So I love this. This was from Home Goods and it was $3.99. Not bad. Next, I have a lot of Tupperware containers. These are all from Dollar Tree. I know this is a Goodwill bag, but they are, they are not from Goodwill, they are from Dollar Tree. So we have this one big Betty Crocker one. This was a dollar by itself, I believe, unless it fell out of a package with the other ones. But yeah, there's that. And then we have Betty Crocker. This size, it's like 5.4 cups. Two Easy Seal storage containers. Those are cute as well. You always need to have Tupperware containers for like leftovers and taking things on the go. And at least in my house I know, we always, always lose the lids to all the containers. So we always end up buying more and it's so annoying. I don't know where the lids go. We also have, these are Rubbermaid actually, not Betty Crocker. These are take-alongs. There's two of them in there. They're a decent size as well for a dollar. Good stuff. And then we have more Betty Crocker, Easy Seal. These are 3.4 cups, kind of like square-ish. My hand's just chilling there awkwardly. <laughs> okay. And then two more Betty Crocker, Easy Seal. 
These are 3.79 cups. Kind of a flat, wider one. I feel like it's good to have different sizes of Tupperware containers too, depending on what you need to put away. I don't remember what's in those. Oh, those are candle holders. Okay. And then I got these Rubble Buddies stainless steel scourers. Scourers? It's <laughs> an awkward word to say. <laughs> yeah, so you're gonna need these in your kitchen. Yeah, it says ideal for grills, broiler racks, and uncoated pots and pans. So, good deal. Two for a dollar. I don't know how these work, but we'll see. Alright, sorry, I had to put all that stuff away, all the containers, because it was getting all in my way. So the next thing, I think most of these are from Dollar Tree except for one. And these are all like chip clips or like just clips. So these say power clips, multi-purpose clips for food storage, small toys, craft supplies, and paper files. So you get five for a dollar. And I love these colors. I think they're so cute. So we got those from Dollar Tree. And these as well are from Dollar Tree, do for a dollar. I like these bigger, like wider ones for chips because I feel like the small ones don't always seal it completely because the bag is too wide. So we got those. And then these are power clips. These are like really, really strong. Like you can already feel it when you open it. These are from Dollar Tree. These are all from Dollar Tree so far. These as well. Pretty cute, three for a dollar, but they're a lot stronger than, a lot stronger than these ones, even though they both say power clips, but these are definitely higher quality. Next, I don't know why I already unpackaged these, but these are from Dollar Tree as well. I thought they were so cute. They're three little like kitty clips, the pink, the orange, and the gray. I thought these were so cute. Especially like if I have kids one day or something, like put these on their snacks or like whatever on their anything because they're little kitties. They're so cute. Okay. And then these last ones, I believe, I think these were from Walmart. These are six magnetic bag clips. So you could stick these on the fridge or do whatever. I don't know. I thought these were a good deal too. I believe they were around like three bucks maybe. Maybe four, I don't really remember. It was a while ago. I didn't get this all in one trip, by the way. This is like stuff I've been getting over time. Just building it up. But yeah, those. I like these colors as well. I think they're really cute. Um, I think that's it for bag clips. So, next item. These came in a two-pack from Dollar Tree. Just like toothpick thing, dispenser with three little holes in it. Uh, it did come in a two pack, but I gave my mom one because our toothpicks are just like in a big like um, rectangular container, and I feel like I feel like this is more practical because these are just I don't know I, f I just think these are cute, so I gave her one of those. This is from Goodwill or no, this is from Dollar Tree. Sorry, this is from Dollar Tree. It's a garlic press. I have not used this yet, but I did go on DollarTree.com and I was reading reviews about these and everyone says it's really good. So I was like, mm, for a dollar, we'll try it out. I do not like chopping my garlic. I do not. Normally I use minced garlic just because it's easier, I feel like. But this, I might actually use garlic cloves since I have this. This is from Dollar Tree as well. <laughs> it's like one of these little um, step shelf. You could use it for like spices. See how they show that? So... I wanted to get more of these, but a lot of the times in the Dollar Tree, they're like bent. So it's not that high quality material. So I feel like they would bend easily, especially if they're just like thrown on the shelf where people throw them around and stuff. So I only got the one, but they usually do have these in stock. So I will be picking up more of these whenever I could find them. And I will probably be using these in my house for like spices. So you could see, I like to have everything organized. And if I had like a spice, cabinet that's like all over the place and you can't even see what's in there mm -mm, i don't like that mm. okay what do we have next some more cups these are super heavy super nice quality these were a dollar at dollar tree both of them i got two of each but i'm only showing you guys one of each just because i don't have that much space on my bed but yeah these are like super cute too like look at that design so cute so cute even on the bottom of the cup you could see 
it's so adorable i love these for like classy for some wine <clears throat> don't drink if you're under 21 and then these are so cute too it's like the same design kind of as these but i don't know it's a little different like a little star in there yeah so these are really nice quality as well they're both like super thick the next thing i got also from dollar tree is this citrus squeezer it's just it's kind of small honestly but i think it'll fit like a small lemon or lime in there um this had good reviews online as well on the dollar tree website and i love drinking like lemon water um i don't usually drink lime water i do like it but i i don't know why i just always like forget about limes so but i do love Lemon and cucumber water is actually my favorite tasting water. Next, we'll go into this stuff. So, from Dollar Tree, I have these two oven mitts. These do come separately, so a dollar for each. Um, I have heard that these aren't the best quality, that sometimes if you like hold something for too long, it can actually burn through the material. Um, but they feel pretty nice. So I feel like for a dollar, we could give them a shot. Just basic gray oven mitt. I do like just basic colors like this. The next, we have <laughs> these oven mitts. They're little fishies. I thought they were so cute. And my boyfriend loves fishing, so I was like, okay, we're going to get these. And these were from Goodwill. I, I know that for sure, but I think I took off the price tag. I believe these were like $2.99, maybe, somewhere around there. I thought they were so cute though, and like for the summer to have these out, mm-hmm, adorable. Next, I just have a little dish towel for winter. It says, let it snow. I only have one of these. I actually won this at um bingo game at my boyfriend's like Christmas family gathering. <laughs> And I was so excited. It is so cute. And this is the last of dish towels. I know I have more somewhere. I just don't know where. Probably somewhere in my basement. These are actually from my mom. She got me these for Valentine's Day for my future house. It is two? Is it two? Yeah. Two pack dual purpose towel. Okay, yeah. I was like, wait, are these for like dishes? These seem really big actually. Or maybe it's just, I don't know. Maybe they're just really thick because this one's a lot smaller but sorry this is how they look they have little easter eggs on them so cute i thought these were adorable so this year for valentine's day literally everything she got me was stuff for my house because i was like don't get me like candy or anything i'm trying to eat healthy like i don't really need anything like so she got me these as part of my gift i love them also got me for valentine's day this beautiful set from home goods it has five piece place setting eight steak knives and five piece hostess set so like i'll show you on the back actually and this was 40 dollars. this was from home goods so you can see all the different utensils and stuff that it comes with and then that's how like the set looks so i was super happy about this because i have not bought myself a silverware silverware set yet i've been buying like more smaller things not really like expensive um stuff yet i still have to buy um a knife knife set you know i want the one like where you keep it on your counter i can't think of what it's called but it's like in the little thing with the slots with for each knife so yeah i need to get one of those still soon <laughs> Well, not really soon, but I just want to have everything so I'm ready to go when the time comes. Okay, the next thing. This is from Home Goods. This was three ninety nine. I thought this was so cute for like washing, like just like a little bit of vegetables or fruit or something. Because I do have the bigger ones too, but I feel like this one is cute for just like washing a little bit of something. You know, I don't know. It's just cute and mini. I love mini stuff. Who doesn't? <laughs> It was funny because um, my boyfriend and I were actually in Home Goods when I got this, and he was like, "Why do you need to get uh, a mini one if you already have the big one?" And I was like, "Because it's cute." <laughs> so I got that. Four bucks, right? Okay, I think I said that. This one is from Walmart. 
I don't remember how much this was. I believe it was like somewhere around two, three bucks. It's plastic. It looks like it's decent quality though. This is for like pasta or something. Like I would not use pasta in this one. This one to like drain pasta or like something else, whatever, something like that. And I love this color, like a little teal, turquoise, aquaish, bluish color. I like that. And then, oh, something was in that bowl. Ew, what was that? Okay. These are, I'll just show you both. These, both of them are from Walmart as well. They're being sold right now for like the spring collection stuff, I believe. This is what it looks like. The bottom, Bradshaw Home. Uh, so it's a seven quart bowl. This one's red, this one's blue. These are plastic, they're white inside, but they're like pretty thick plastic. Like I feel like these are gonna be good. They're pretty cute. So I was like, eh, yeah, for a few bucks each. I was like, why not? So we got those. And then here, I believe this is a bag full of Dollar Tree stuff. So we have a bread pan. You're always gonna need a bread pan. I love banana bread. Um, Can't really eat it right now, unfortunately, but I love banana bread or like a pumpkin bread or something like that. Mm, delicious. And then I got this handheld grater, also from Dollar Tree. I like how there's like different like settings on there. So this looks like it'll be good as well. And then we have a brownie pan, just basic brownie pan. It's kind of small, and I don't. I usually like stuff that's like um, like the darker stuff. I feel like it's better with nonstick, like. The darker whatever makes it not stick as much. Yeah. Okay. But these are for a dollar. So we'll just see how they work before I buy other ones and spend more money. And then I don't know where I got this. It says charger plate. Uh, yeah, I don't know. Charger plate. This is from Dollar Tree as well. This was like the only one. It was misplaced randomly on a shelf. But I thought this was so cute. Not like for to actually eat off of, but like for uh, like some type of decor around like i don't know maybe the fall time or whatever just like put something on here in the middle maybe charger plate is meant for decorations i don't really know what charger plate is but i thought this was so cute i wish they had another one because i like to do things like in like um like doubles but this will be fine i'm still happy i find found it maybe if i find another one one day i could get another one of these the next thing is a square cake pan, also from Dollar Tree. Again, wish it was darker so it could not stick as much. Maybe that's just a misconception that I have though. Maybe it's still gonna be non-stick. It doesn't say non-stick though. But yeah, this is for a dollar as well. So I got the bread pan, the brownie pan, and the cake pan. Oh, I have this really cute pink round cake cake can cake can cake pan oh my god i was like why does that sound wrong i have like a round pink one it's so cute but it's somewhere downstairs in my basement and i don't know where it is but i just remembered it and i brought this stuff all up yesterday before i started filming this video so the next thing i have this was from goodwill this was a dollar 29 it's a magnetic pad you stick on your fridge and it is an all out of pad so you could see there's like different categories, fruits, vegetables, canned goods, frozen, frozen foods, condiments, spices, deli, meat and fish, blah, blah, blah. The list goes on. But yeah, so you could see them all there. I thought this was so cool. This will be great for like shopping and it's magnetic. So you could just stick it on your fridge and right when you see you're out of something, you could just mark it real quick. For $1.29, I was like, oh my God, this is like so practical. So I have that. And next. We're gonna go into all of the um, utensils and stuff. Okay. Oh wait, I actually do have some more clips. I forgot about these. I don't remember where I got these. They're in a Dollar General bag, but I don't believe these are from Dollar General. Anyway, six little clips. And then we got this Betty Crocker two cup measuring cup. This is from Dollar Tree. Cute. 
We always need a measuring cup. I do want to get a higher quality one eventually, but this will do for now. I haven't even moved out yet, so I should probably chill. <laughs> and then um, a Betty Crocker peeler. This looks really nice. I love these type of peelers. So we got that. And then these are all from Dollar Tree. So we have a bamboo spoon, a bamboo fork, and a bamboo slotted spoon. And my hair is stuck in there. Of course, my hair is everywhere all the time. So we have these three spoons, a dollar each. I love the look of like wooden spoons and you get them like on a, in a container, like on your kitchen counter. So cute. I still need to get like a container for all my kitchen utensil stuff. And this was just a random find actually. This was from Goodwill, yeah. These are a dollar, these were a dollar. These are like cookie sticks. So these could be for like um, cake pops or something. And this is the brand Wilton. So normally I feel like this, this brand is kind of more expensive. Well, obviously more expensive than a dollar. And you get 60 of these for a dollar at Goodwill. So this was a really good find. I like to make like um, cake balls and stuff or cake pops, sorry. Super cute. You can make them for like all different occasions and stuff. And look at what they picture on their like little those would be cute for Valentine's Day. Aww. Okay, next up we have a basting brush. Just cute little plastic yarn. And I also have another one. These are both from Dollar Tree. This is the like Dollar Tree brand cooking concepts. My hair. <laughs> and then this one is from Dollar Tree too, too, but it's Betty Crocker. It's a little bit different here. Not really. These are just like thicker and these are thinner. You could see the difference in those. Those were a dollar each. My hair is just not, not going well today. Okay. And then we have a slotted spoon. This is from Dollar Tree as well. Just basic slotted spoon for the kitchen and a solid spoon for the kitchen as well. Obviously, this is all for the kitchen. I should stop saying that. From Dollar Tree. Ooh, a dishwasher safe. Cool. And then I have some spatulas. These are both from Dollar Tree as well. A white one and a red one. I love rubber spatulas for like scraping the bowl when you're making anything because wooden spoon just doesn't cut it, you know. An ice cream scoop. Cute little scoop for a dollar. And these two next items are not from Dollar Tree. They are from Home Goods, but I feel like everything else I have is from Dollar Tree. So my mom got me this as part of my Valentine's Day gift as well. This was $2.99 and it is a huge ladle. Like, look at how tall this thing is. This part is like normal size, but I feel like the like um, handle for it is really long, which is cool. I like this ladle a lot. Sorry, for $2.99, this was a great deal. I was like so happy when she gave me my Valentine's Day gift. I was like, yes, girl, you already know. This is the exact type of stuff I want and need. She's like, she's like, I tried not to get you anything that I know you already have. Cause I like always show her like all this stuff when I buy it. Cause it's like fun, whatever. Now I get to show you guys too, which is awesome. But she's like, yeah, I was hoping I didn't get you anything you already had. And I was like, I hope you didn't get me like a salt and pepper grinder. Cause that's like, I got that the same day that she got all my gifts for Valentine's Day. She's like, no, I didn't know. I was like, okay. This was $3.99. A whisk, cute whisk from Home Goods, And I made sure that the whisk doesn't have like a opening over here because then the water will get stuck in there and leak out whenever I use it. Not always, but like if it doesn't dry. And then these are random. I thought I had four of these. Maybe not. I got these like probably over a year ago, maybe more from Dollar Tree for like a hot pan. I forgot what these are called, something with a T, I believe. But I believe there were four. I don't know where the fourth one went. Maybe it'll show up someday. I do not even remember how much these cost. All I know is they were from Goodwill and I got them like over a year ago. Well, those are cute, just plain black. And okay. This is the last bag of goodies, and then we are done. Another spatula. 
Betty Crocker red one. I'm gonna have a lot of spatulas because why not, right? And then a mesh strainer. This is good for like washing your rice or whatever before you cook it. Um, I don't really know what else I would use this for though. I have a thing in the basement too, like a sifter. I don't know where it is. I didn't bring it up here because I looked at everything before I started this video. So I do have some more stuff in the basement somewhere, but I'm sorry I couldn't find it. So yeah, I got this sifter. Just lost my train of thought. <laughs> and then I got this Betty Crocker pizza cutter, also from Dollar Tree for a dollar. Hopefully this works well. I'm not sure. And then here is a whisk I got from Dollar Tree. So you can see what I mean now with this one. There's like holes in the bottom. See that? And this one doesn't have those holes. So the water will probably get stuck in this one and leak all over the place. Whatever, I'll use that one probably only when I absolutely need to. I got some Betty Crocker salad tongs from Dollar Tree. These were also a dollar. And then just some regular tongs. Cooking concepts. Sorry, I thought I heard someone coming to my room. And then I have a slaughter turner. This is Betty Crocker as well. This is good for like pancakes and stuff or like an omelet maybe, whatever. Solid turner, same thing, pancakes, omelet. I don't really know what I'm gonna use the slotted and the solid one for, like, like what what different items would I use them for? Like, I feel like I could use these interchangeably is what I'm trying to say. And then a slotted spoon. This will be good for like, if you're eating like, if you're taking out like ground meat or something and you want to get the juices out or whatever. I don't know. It's gonna be used. <laughs> and then this cake server. I thought this thing is so cute. Get a little slice of cake. Delicious and a potato masher. So I think I read reviews about this on the Dollar Tree website at one point and I'm pretty sure they weren't that good. But it's fine. It was a dollar and eventually I'll get a better one if this one sucks. So whatever. And then this is such a good deal. First of all for a dollar. I'm so excited. I need to tell you. Okay. So it comes with measuring spoons and measuring cups this is an eight piece set and the thing i love the most about these is that the measurements are like oh, i don't think you could see it hold on measurements are like on there they're not written on they're like like the what i'm trying to say is the paint is not gonna come off over the years because i do have some measuring like cups and bowl sets cups and bowl sets yeah i, I like can't talk today i don't know what's going on but where the paint comes off and then eventually you're like, I don't know what measurement this is. <laughs> and like most of them I could tell like the difference between like a fourth and a third and a half cup but whatever. But like sometimes like the tablespoon ones or like the teaspoon ones, I'm like, I don't know. And if I'm baking something, I'm not about to put the wrong measurement because it's going to mess up the whole whatever it is I'm baking. Okay, this is the last item. This is from Dollar Tree as well. It is a four pack of little mini bowls. I thought these were so cute for just like a side of like ketchup or ranch or whatever, like a sauce or something. Yeah, I think somebody made me get these. I can't remember if it was my boyfriend or my little sister, but they were like, just get them, just get them. And I was like, okay. So they're really cute because I didn't even see them at first. All right. Um. Okay, so it looks like that is it for my kitchen haul i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did please give me a thumbs up subscribe to a comment down below what you liked what you didn't like uh what videos do you want to see next and thank you so much for watching and i hope you guys have a great rest of your day